guys, what's up? I'm Jill and welcome back to my channel for another new hacks video. Today we are doing a very exciting video on one of my absolute favorite things and that is decor. I love room decor, love buying new things for my room and my apartment and just setting it up. So I wanted to share some hacks and some tips about how you might be able to switch up your room with things that you already have or just some general room decor rules that I tend to follow. But of course there really are no rules when it comes to decorating. You can do whatever your little heart desires. I can't wait to get into this video with you guys, but before we do, I want to remind everyone to make sure to click subscribe if you haven't already. If you're new here, it's your first time seeing my face. Hi, I'm Jill. And also make sure that you check me out on all of my social media. I'm going to have links to absolutely everything right down below. And now let's get into the video. Hey! We're like you and I Two blue hearts locked in our own mind so this first life hack is for those of you who want to secure lights to your headboard on your bed. All you need to do is take these teeny tiny nails and if you have a fabric headboard like mine, you can slide them right in there and then secure your lights in place and it will not damage your headboard at all. Seriously, when you pull the nail out, since they're so small, you seriously can't tell that a hole was put in there and it is going to hold them in place so well. It's gonna be super discreet and no one will even be able to tell how you're hanging them there, which makes them look really, really cute. This is how I hang mine and I absolutely love it. My next life hack is for storing and displaying any hats that you have. All you need to do is put a push pin into your wall and then go ahead and hang your hats on it. And I just think this looks really cute. It's a really cute way to decorate your room, a really cute way to display your accessories, and a really easy way to store your hat if you're worried about getting it thrown around and then it might get misshaped, which would be terrible. So I highly recommend giving this one a try in your bedroom. When I saw this life hack online, I freaked because it is so smart. So if you always have trouble figuring out where nails need to go in the wall so that they're the right length apart, all you need to do is take some tape, measure it from nail hole to nail hole on your piece of art, and then go ahead and put that on your wall. And then you can use the tape line to level out the way that your picture will look. And once you have that in place, you can put in your nails or your screws or whatever you want, and then hang up whatever it is you're hanging and voila, you have it absolutely perfect. Your nails are going to be in the exact right spot it's going to be perfectly leveled this is seriously a lifesaver and i'm going to use this hack for the rest of my life This next hack is a little rule that I created for myself called the rule of three. And the idea is that you have something big, medium, and small when you're trying to decorate a table, like a side table. For example, this one, I actually use this on both of my side tables. And so I'm going to show you both of them and the way that I sort of designed both of them. So for this one, I went with my Himalayan salt lamp, a little plant, and then a candle. And all of these things have really neutral colors. And so they look really pretty together. And you can see how having the three different sizes gives it a really nice and organized and put together look while also still looking like perfectly designed in my opinion. So on the other side of my bed, I use the exact same idea, except this time I'm using a lamp, this cool little sphere that I got from Target, and then another little plant. And it's the exact same idea. I have something big, medium, and small in there, and it just really helps to balance out the table and helps give you an idea of how you should decorate it and what things you should look for when you go to the store. Baby, this is what you came for. Like so this one is just for people who prefer a less mishmash look in their room. If all of the different book bindings sort of gives you a headache because it looks so crazy together, just turn your books around. Obviously this isn't as convenient for finding the books you're looking for, but if you're just looking to style a shelf, try this out. I actually think this looked really cool. My next life hack is just to add some more greenery into your space. Now, seriously, every single plant I have in my room is fake. And I still think that this brings so much life and a nice pop of color to my room and really just sort of feels like the space is complete. So here's an example of two different plants that I have. And you guys already saw another plant that I keep on my side table. And I have a few others around my room. And I just find that this really helps to bring my room together and make it feel really homey. <laughs> Plus, you never have to water fake plants, which is totally ideal. And that's it 
it for today's video. I hope that you guys enjoyed it. If you did, don't forget to give it a huge thumbs up. Also, don't forget to tell me which room decor life hack was your favorite. I think mine was probably the tape along whatever you're trying to hang because seriously, that's a lifesaver. When I found that online, I was like, oh my gosh, I'm going to use that forever now. So make sure you let me know down below which of the hacks was your favorite. And also if you have any requests for new DIYs or hack videos or really whatever you wanna see. I love you all so much and I'll see you in my next video. Bye.